student learning and campus life aren't any better, even when the university generates over 90 billion internally. As a result, it's common for functional units, academic and administrative departments, and staff at McKinney University to lack the following. Basic office facilities and equipment facilitate teaching and research, and majority buy themselves office chairs, tables, computers, laptops, and printing for, to perform university activities. Chemicals and samples for practicals, science courses are now being taught like humanities and social sciences in many instances. I, adequate, they lack, we lack adequate funds to undertake, to take out students for field-based courses, such as forestry, environment, natural science, veterinary medicine, etc. Lack of adequate funding for research from internally generated funds, only approximately 600 million is allocated each year for research on issues of national significance, leaving us reliant on donor funds that usually focus on popular discourses of a global nature. Crackdown on honest opinions and gagging is on the increase at Makere University contrary to Article 29 of the Constitution of the Republic of Uganda. In the last two years, the Vice Chancellor has devised can understand me management methods aimed at identifying and threatening staff members who are critical to his administration, other injustices and malfunctions into submission. How can you be a research-led university when you have allocated 600 billion to research? Two, when you compare with other budgets, for example, the vice chancellor and all the other academic leaders who are the most highly paid, they came up in the budget with a leadership allowance. This is an allowance which they pay themselves, totaling 5 billion per year. 